Hi guys, it's Sam here. In today's episode, I'm gonna be playing Ocarina of Time. Uh, this is my second game I ever played in my life, uh, so it's pretty nostalgic. I'm playing on the GameCube because uh, it's cause high quality. Uh, then on the N64 because I I live in Europe, in the UK, so it doesn't look as good as it could do. Uh, so yeah, we move on the new far. Let's go. In the vast deep forest of Hyrule, long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. And you can see Link chilling. Each Kokiri has his or her own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Oh, he's 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 dreaming something scary. Oh, is Jananendorf. The big scary Gerudo. And now we get to see my favorite character. <laughs> the one who doesn't shut up. Yeah, this. Uh, basically, Hero Deku Tree. He's like a. He's like a psychic. <laughs> Just knows everything. So, uh, so Link um, lives with the Kikiri, but you guys probably know he's, he's, he's spoilers. He's, he's not a Kikiri, but you probably know that because the game's been out for like how long? I don't even know. A while. <laughs> but the Deku is given the role to Navi to, to help Link or Sunfi, even because that's what I named him. We get to see Navi fly towards Link in first person. And through, I think his name is Mido. Through, through like, annoying kid's legs. Yeah. <laughs> hey. I always thought this bit was pretty cool. Especially when she. She? Is it a she? When it hits its head. I always thought Navi was a girl, so Navi's gonna be a girl. <laughs> I've just decided. Hello. No, I, I don't. I don't want to talk to the Great Deku Tree. I'm, I'm slammed. Whoa! That was insulting us. Us? Me? I don't know. All right, and now we get to play. I think it's still the like like highly rated game ever. It's, a rich, it's such a good game. Uh, I actually prefer the 3DS one though. But that is that is probably because <laughs> of the gyro controls and how easy it is for the to use the bow. Because you have to use that, especially as in, like you use the pellets as a kid. And look, there's Saria with a really weird green hair. Well, I don't even care. She can, she can stay there. All right. So, uh, so in order for us to see the great Deku Tree, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta get the sword and the shield. And in order to do that, we gotta get the sword and the shield. Oops. <laughs> Alright, so the sword is in a chest down here. Uh, I don't know why. I don't know why no one else has ever taken it. Alright, 
I think there's five rupees here. There is. Oh, boulder. And the sword's here. Whoa, what, what could it be? It's almost like it's gonna be the sword. Whoa, it's the Kakiri sword. This is hidden treasure of the Kokiri, but you can borrow it and never give it back. All right, so we got equipped. We got equipped it, and now we can kill things. Yeah. Okay. I want to. If this is gonna be hard, this is gonna give me a rupee. It gave me nothing. Okay, nice. <laughs> so. You need, I think it's, is it 40? I think it's 40 rupees to get the shield. And that shouldn't, that should hopefully not be too difficult. Oh. Right. Uh, I, I think destroying the signs. Is that did not do anything? Am I stupid? No sign. Can I, can, I, can I pick up the rock? Okay, no. <laughs> There's also this jumping. Uh, yeah, these things. They give you five rupees every time. I don't know if you can... I don't even remember if you can just keep doing them. Let's try. Okay, never mind. Rupees. I don't know how many Zelda games start off with you needing rupees. But, um... It's kind of funny though, because in Majora's Mask, you start off needing to get uh, your sword and shield by getting the Ocarina and the Song of Healing. So, just in one game, you've got to do a complete cycle of three days. And uh, this game, you got to get rupees. So, I actually, I prefer Majora's Mask. Oh, I can't destroy that one. So... When I when I finish this playthrough, uh, I don't know how long that'll take me. But when that happens, I'll probably do Majora's Mask. But I don't own the GameCube version on that in that Zelda collection, so I might just get on the Wii U eShop if it's on there. I don't even remember if it is. Oh. Ten rupees off, and there's there's five in the shop, so. And I think there's this house. I don't know which, which house it is, though. Is it this one? Is this the house of the chest? Nope. <laughs> some, some, some hearts. You know what? We got enough. No, I don't want to. No. Leave me alone. Do -do 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 It was 40 rupees. Yay. All right, so we, I would not like to buy anything. I, I can't buy anything else. All right, so let's equip this. Oh, yes. We have, we've got the, the shield. So now we can, not cut him. If you want to see the Great Deku Tree, you should at least equip a sword and shield. Oh, you have the Deku Shield, and what's that? Is that the Kukiri Sword? Good grief. Yeah, this I I never knew when I was younger because I was probably like three or four because uh, I grew up with the N64. Even though I wasn't, it came out uh, like I I I was I was I was I I can speak. I was born. When the GameCube came out, like, around that time. But my dad had an N64 with Mario, Ocarina of Time, and Banjo. So, those are my first few games. I never beat any of them, I don't think, when I was younger. I think the furthest I got in was probably Ocarina of Time. So, I, I'm not going to really cut any of these, because I just want to play the game <laughs> on camera. 
Because I wasn't really sure what game I wanted to play. So I wanted to make a video for like a while, but I never, never, you know. I never knew what I wanted to do. Just realized, actually, I'm going to get the, some Deku sticks and nuts. Because I don't, actually, you know, this. There's actually some in the in the temple, so I don't really know why I did that. Well, I don't even care. Let's go and get this thing shot. Because I... I like this link shot. Inside the Deku Tree. I think this was probably the most simple dungeon in all of Zelda. I, I'm trying to think of one that's, that's, you know, more, more simple. Navi, I know. They shouldn't, they should have, like, made a way to disable her. I mean, maybe there is. I don't know. But that would be pretty cool. So, I okay, is the dungeon, is this the dungeon map? I may as well get it. <clears throat> the dungeon map, it is a map of the dungeon. One thing I really like about the, uh, the, uh, the, the temples for when you're a kid is that they have, like, unique names. Instead of just Spirit Temple, Water Temple, stuff like that. And I guess it makes sense, but... Deku Scrub. Oh, get back here. Whoa! I never even realised that you could run away. What, what the hell? Why you not... Just come here. Okay. Forgive me, Master. If you give... I will give you a clue. When you jump up a high cliff, you can hold forward. I know that. Actually, in the 3DS version, I don't think that works. Well, at least it doesn't work for me, but... Maybe there is a way to do it. I don't know. Boom. Slingshot, let's go. Yeah, so, um... This game is... It's not even that... It's just weird, because it's got a massive open world, but it's quite linear. Like, you can't really get lost. I mean, in the dungeons you can, but... Not in the... Like, story. You just do what you gotta do. Saying that, in the in the playthrough, I definitely will, will get lost. And then all of you will be able to... All the two people that will be watching this... Will be able to bully me, and I'll, I'll feel like a failure. Right. So my goal for this video is to get is to beat Goma, beat Goma, get the forest thingy, my Bob, whatever it's called. I don't even remember. Remember. And then we can then we can do stuff. Oh, don't know, I'm looking that way. Rupees. Yes. Okay, so now... What do you even have to get? I don't even remember. I think it's the compass. So I might just skip out on that. Because I don't care. So, is it... These little guys? Okay, you're not... You know I may as well do the room. Because I... I think there's a gold skull floor in there anyway. So and the thing is, you can you can, they're optional, but they if you get ten, you get to increase your wallet. And I really want to do that because ninety nine is not enough. Yay! Now I know where to go. Well, even though I already I already knew where to go. Deku sticks. Yay. I don't ever use Deku sticks. Unless... I don't... Actually, no, I don't think I do. So there's a... Gold skull to learn here. I think. I might be wrong. 
No, there it is. I can see it. No, no, no. I, I missed the jump. Because I'm such a failure. All right. I <laughs> I don't have low self-esteem. I just... Oh! I got wrecked by that. I'm actually about to... I'm actually about to die. Is that actually what's going to happen? Unless there's a heart in here. Oh, I don't actually remember what's in here. Oh, it's a heart. Okay. So now... We are already done with the top half of... The dungeon. You can even call it a dungeon. Yes. Oh, loads of hearts. So I won't die now. Am I stupid? Am I is am I stupid? Yes. Are you meant to I remember. Are you meant to just jump? I, I swear you're meant to just jump. Oh. You know what? Do I, do I, do I care? No. Alright. Rupees. Okay. What am I doing? Right. Yeah, but, uh... The N64 version, like, the... N64 version of this game is quite dated. I don't I don't know what it's just the controller, I think. Uh, for me it is anyway. So and the GameCube controller is awesome to use. Because you get to use the uh the C stack to move uh like to use your items, not the camera as well as well as the camera. But you don't need to use the camera. Right. Are you kidding me? Am I am I actually being stupid? One second. Okay, you had to jump right in the middle. I'm so stupid. Yeah, get out of there. Fucking Deku Baba. Okay. Uh, over here. There's another skull to there. Okay. <laughs> I was trying to style on the on the on the token. Yeah, 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 two boy. I think there's another one literally here as well. Is it just right there? Oh, it's a chest. Oh, it's there. It's right there. I got all the gold sculptors in like one of my one of my my earlier playthroughs of the game. But I, I honestly can't be bothered now, because I get, I get, I get a few, so I can, you know, actually collect and buy things. But on a normal playthrough, I just normally get the biggest wallet, and then I don't care about the rest. I don't even remember the prizes for getting them all. It probably is the biggest wallet. Well, there's a lot of, there's a, there's a lot of, of skulls in the game. Okay. Yeah, that's what you meant to do. Please forgive me, Master. It's 231, I think the password is. I'll teach you something cool. You will never beat my brothers up ahead unless you punish them in the proud order. Or proper, even. I can't read. Okay, yeah, it's 231. I'm so clever. Alright. Oh. Wrong, wrong room. So you guys probably already know this, but I, I I'm not gonna do 100% on this run. I'm just gonna beat the game. Uh, I might do some side quests like the Goron one because the sword is OP, and the side quest is just fun. I, I I'm just gonna do everything that's fun. If it's not fun, don't expect me to do it. If it's fun, I'll probably do it. If the water goes up, I might just cry. Yes. Oh, that time is a lot. That's punishing. Yes. Okay. 
Stand next to this block and grab hold of it. Who's that? Yeah, if, so, my favourite, this is probably my, my two favourite uh, N64 games is Majora's Mask and Ocarina of Time. Because Zelda's my favourite franchise, why would I not love Zelda? But, my, my Mario 64 for me is, like, if I wanted to beat that game, I would have to want to beat it, if you know what I mean. Like, I don't necessarily want to not beat this game. It's just like, I don't have to want to beat it. I just always want to beat it. That don't make any sense. Is, that, is there a sculptor in here? No, it's just Deku Bubbles. I don't care about Deku Bubbles. Friggin', does anyone like Deku Bubbles? No. No one likes Deku Oh! That scared me. So you can actually come back here when you get the bombs. I don't actually remember what's behind there. So. Yeah. Yeah, Goma is a pretty cool boss fight there, so. I'm quite excited to fight Goma again. Um. Gotta push this down. I don't remember how many gold sculptors there is. If there's if there's more than three, that's gonna be quite annoying. Right. And we're basically at the end of the temple. So we're gonna do the awesome deed now. Oh, do I have to stun him? No, he's already stunned. What? No! Not again. Okay, God's sake, alright. Yes! How did you know our secret? How irritating. It's so annoying that I'm going to reveal the secret of Queen Goma. In order to adm administer the... The Coupe de Grace. I've, have, have I just never known something? Probably. Coupe de Grace. What does that even mean? Well, I, I'm doing French at school. I just don't even know what it means. If that, that is, I'm pretty sure it's French. Because de is French. And I think coupe. Is that like a shorter version of beaucoup? Which means a lot. Who knows? That's the coolest part. No one knows. Maybe Goma knows. Parasitic armored arachnid. Whoa. Go on, climb up there, you little fridge magnet. And that's the Deku tree. I didn't die, so you can't bully me. Yeah, and we get a sweetheart container. Ooh. I don't even know how long this video is. I don't even care though. I'm just happy that I'm finally making YouTube videos again. Because honestly, I do it just because it's fun. It's fun just to have videos that you of things that you like. And I really like Zelda. And I hope you guys really like Zelda. I mean, who doesn't like Zelda? Now I have yet more to tell thee, but thou'st like to listen. No. Why ask me then? Why? Oh, it's Gran and Rolf. 
I mean, he looked weird in this game, but in the 3DS version, they made his head, like, basically 2D. <laughs> he has just the flattest head in the world. So, do you guys want to know about Dranendorf? No, you don't. Ganondorf, no one likes you. So, so, I mean, actually, that's a lie. I like you, but not... I only like you because your boss is cool. I've played this game like a dozen times and I still don't even remember the names. I think there's Nehru. Okay, Din, Nehru, and I think it's Feral. Is it Feral? Okay. So I, I do kind of know them. I just forgot Din. So... I'm pretty sure on Breath of the Wild, the dragons are named after them, like, kind of. Because I, I, I can remember is there's Farosh, I think. I don't even remember. Yeah, so it's, it's, it's close to Christmas, so I'm hoping that... Actually, what I might do is after Christmas sometime, I might get a capture card because I'm just recording on my phone and I don't really mind, but it's not as good as the video could look. And they formed the Triforce! Weird. For me though, the game truly gets amazing once you get Adult Link. Because for me, that's just when like the awesome puzzles and stuff comes in. So, stay tuned for that. I might do a video every couple of days, because, I don't know, I've not uploaded a video in a couple months. So who knows when I'll do the next. So now, it's really sad, the Great Deku Tree is going to die. And that's depressing. But he's not gone forever. Because he's in the Wind Waker. Go to Hyrule Castle, and we're going to meet... Zelda. Zelda. And that part of the game is actually awesome. But I'm not going to do that in this episode. Because I don't want to. Actually, no, I kind of want to, but... I don't want to make, to make the episodes too long. Whoa, we got uh, one of those, like, apple sweets. The Kokiri Emerald. Wow. That is a very tasty emerald. The future depends upon thee, Sunfee. Thou art courageous. Navi the fairy helps Sunfee to carry out my will. I entreat to ye. Navi... Good. Bye. That's just that actually makes me sad. He just turns grey. I think this this moment would be really sad if it wasn't for Link just <laughs> running away afterwards. Like that, that that's sad and then Link just <laughs> he runs away. So, whoa, Mido, get out of my way. Yeah, Mido, you better walk off. I'll, I'll just... Wait a minute. Anyway, if you guys like this episode, like, subscribe, and I'll see you all in my next video sometime in 2020. See you guys. Goodbye.